So guys, got a uh, Commodore filing cabinet. Um, it's in great shape. Let's go through it. So first of all, measurements top to bottom. It's 27 inches deep, nice and nice long uh, throw to the back. 15 wide, 52 inches tall. This cabinet is set up for letter sized. So if you have letter sized files, that's where it's at. Um, Commodore build quality, you know, like if you've been out to Walmart or even some of the lower end staples units, you know that the steel they use is very low gauge and so they start to get rickety. This is very solid. Uh, Commodore is the word in filing cabinets. Um, all the drawers function properly. And in each drawer actually we've got a, a lettered tab system which you can take out if you want uh, or you can use it. Basically you just, you know, um, there is a slider on the bottom. You can use a file folder like that, but all of the, or you can just set files right into the unit. Every drawer though has a spring compressor, or like a, a file compressor. So what you do is you, let's pretend you have this many files. All you'd have to do is simply move the compressor up, and then that holds your files in place. And all the drawers do that. You could, if you wanted, install file hangers, but that's a pretty, good system from the perspective that you just basically move this up to the size of your files and then their own weight keeps them erect. So, you know, can I tell you, if you haven't seen that before, that's how it works. But yeah, all the drawers, another thing about Commodore cabinets, like look how easy it slides, nice and easy. There's also some extra hardware here, this is anti-tip hardware. If you want to install this on the back in case you're worried about the cabinet tipping, I'm just going to include that with it. But um, it's a great cabinet. Cosmetically, uh, the only issue, there's a little mark on the top. I thought about painting it, but I'll just ask 10 bucks less and you get the advantage. So, other than that, it's perfect. Send me a text, email, or phone call. I'll sell it to you. Thanks, guys.